This was supposed to be our victory dinner, but after getting our butts kicked and our egos handed to us on a platter, I thought I'd make a comfort dish, you know, something to ease the pain. This recipe is called pasta al forno. Pasta al forno is basically any type of pasta baked in the oven and any type of sauce. One of my favorite sauces is just with a little bit of eggplant, some sun-dried tomatoes, and some olives. Any type of olives I like in Fornati. These are the olives that are a little wrinkly, very salty, a lot of flavor. And to pit them, press on your knife and you can squeeze out the pits very easily. My favorite part of the pasta al forno is the cheese. This is mozzarella, nice and creamy. Just cut it up to little chunks. And I like to always add something else to my pasta al forno, which is scamorza. And this is a smoked, soft provolone style cheese. While the pasta is cooking, I'm gonna make my sauce. A little bit of extra virgin olive oil, of course. A little bit of garlic. Add in your eggplant. Now be careful at this stage, you may be tempted to add more olive oil. Eggplant has a tendency of acting like a sponge, it will absorb all your olive oil. Now if you add more, it will just become heavy like a brick in your stomach. Just add in your sun-dried tomatoes and your olives right into the same pot. Just saute it together with the eggplant for a few minutes. For the super easy part of this recipe, I just have a jar of pureed tomato. And a little bit of water. Now just a little bit of salt. The best part of pasta al forno for me is that you really can't screw it up. Pasta sometimes can be tricky to cook, you know, the whole al dente thing. But with this type of recipe, even if you make it scotta, which is like mushy, once you put it in the oven, it gets cooked, it becomes nice and crunchy and I'm telling you, you can't go wrong. Now give your rigatoni a really good mix in the sauce. Add a little bit of parmigiano. Put it in half and then start adding all your cheese right around. Mix it up, a little bit of the scamorza. Start seeing it melt. The guys are gonna freak. Just finish it off with a little more parmigiano. This is gonna get baked in the oven for about 30 minutes at around 400 degrees or until it becomes nice and crunchy and crispy and golden brown. Oh, ragazzi. Oh, you guys look beat up. Oh, where's my beer? Yeah, they're still talking about how good you guys played. No, you couldn't even save a beach ball. This is to getting the shape with ping pong and badminton. All right, I got some job. Maybe it was a good thing we got our butts kicked. You know, it's made us more humble. But it's uh, the better game in my life. It was the best game in your life. Imagine the worst game. <laughs> no, seriously, guys, I don't know what's going on. We used to play well, we used to be in shape. It seems like the only thing we're good at is eating. Guys, we'll start tomorrow. We'll have like a little boot camp. Non-stop fitness. Boot camp. From the morning right to the night. Straight fitness. But we start tomorrow, right? Okay. Tomorrow. Right in early. 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 Tomorrow. To getting into shape, guys. Getting into shape.